We have been so fortunate the past couple of Christmases to have our next guest with us singing his iconic holiday classics. However, he's also known for his unforgettable love songs, and he is back with us today to sing my funny Valentine. Welcome back, Thank our you great very much. friend, the incomparable Johnny Mathis. Welcome back. Johnny, we love you. We love you. We're Thank so you for coming back. Good to see you again, my friend. Thank you. You know, Johnny, I feel like for the last six decades, you have been responsible for a lot of people falling in love and a lot of babies being born. <laughs> so I think it's safe to say that you're giving Cupid a run for his money. Oh, bless your heart. Right. Well, well, that's true. Actually, uh, that's not true. Uh, I, uh, I, sing, uh, I sing because my dad sang. Uh, he had six other children, and uh, my mom and my dad were my best pals. And uh, I, I remember at uh, the age of uh, 18, when I was uh, uh, coming from school, and Pop said uh, that there's a man from Columbia Records who wants to hear you sing. And I said, wow, that's nice. And so I sang for him. Next thing I know, I was on a plane to New York making my first recording. My dad was my best pal, and uh, he also sang, and that's why I sing. And you do oh, such a gosh. beautiful job of it. And like uh, Debbie alluded to, you sing for so many uh, couples out there, including famous couples. But when it comes to head over heels in love, in your words, there was one couple that really stands out, Nancy and Ronald Reagan. Yeah, Meeting yeah. them, and they just looked so in love, didn't they? Yeah, and uh, they are big supporters of mine, have been for many years. I sang at the White House for them uh, on many, many occasions. And uh, they even chimed in uh, during the song in the parts that they knew. <laughs> yeah. Oh, very wow. sweet. Wow, having the very president sweet. sing with you? That's I amazing. Yeah. I bet he felt the same way. He's yeah. like, I'm singing oh, with Johnny exactly Mathis. Right. <laughs> Listen, it's really no surprise that your fans all over the world fall in love with you. As a matter of fact, we have all fallen in love with you. You can see our family here. But there was one fan in particular one lovely woman that could not contain herself at a concert you gave in Long Island. Tell us what happened. Yeah, a lot of crazy stuff, but, but always meant in, in kindness and, and in goodness, not in bad things. So she jumped on stage in yeah. the middle of your singing? Yeah. And you just carried on and danced yeah. with her? And Dancing her and singing. Yeah. That's the way to handle it. <laughs> what I mean, else are you going to do, right? She's got love for you. You showed love for her, too. Yeah. It's very kind. You're a kind, <laughs> kind man, and that's the point for sure. Very important to embrace them, yes. That's okay, right. Well, it sounds like a little bit of a funny Valentine, if I do say so myself. <laughs> Swoon. Oh, I, feel yes. like, oh. I feel like the lady in Long Island right now. <laughs> if you want to see Johnny perform in person, you all can visit johnnymathis.com for concert date info.